Right, I've got to admit, when I made the Alien video, the last one, okay, I thought that's pretty much the end of it. That's most of the information. A lot of people now are just like, like rinse and repeating the same info. But oh my goodness gracious me, man, when I thought I was going to put it to bed, more stuff came to light. And I'm like, can this even be possible? Is this even real? So I need you to try to help me find out if this is real, man. You just need to have an open mind. I've been looking at your comments. Man, I mean, I can't even tell you what... It's a, it's a very eclectic range of um, comments. Some saying it's totally real. Some saying that it's demons. There's no such thing as aliens. It's demons and fallen angels. Some people are saying it's a complete conspiracy theory. Some people are saying this is it. The world is going to end. Mate, this is going absolutely nuts. But you are going to be absolutely blown away by especially two of the videos. I'm going to show you a couple of the interviews, not interviews, witness statements, okay, um, that you may have seen already, but I want to just sort of break it down. But there's going to be, like like the last one, two videos this time, like I say, which is just going to blow your mind, okay? There was one video that I didn't actually show you the other day, which I've seen before, and I've, I've watched it twice now, but like the second time I was like, no, I, I don't really want to pay atten much to attention to this too much because I want to break it down when I speak to you guys. The first one, um, what should I do? Yeah, 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 yeah. So the first one is somebody claiming that his dad works for the Miami police, okay? In fact, coming up as sheriff of some sort, right? And he's saying, I can't talk about it, right? This is the video. My dad's a police officer in Miami. And I mean, like, he's even running for sheriff. And I, I just talked to him. He didn't say anything about that. Hey. Hey, did you, uh, have you been seeing the alien stuff? Did you see that at the, the Bayside? Uh, Are you serious? You're, you're joking. You're joking. <laughs> Did they tell you not to talk about it? How many times do you want me to slice the pie? I'm not allowed to talk about it. I, I do know what you're talking about, but I'm not allowed to talk about it. He says, I know what you're talking about, but I'm not allowed to talk about it. Can you, well, okay, can you at least say, like, whatever? So, okay, so they're saying it's like a... Um, like a fight broke out. Why did they send so many police cars? Yeah, a bunch of kids with sticks. Are you serious? You can't say you can't say any. I don't know what else you want me to say. You're no help, dude. I'm sorry. Right. So uh, the thing that I think is a little bit suspicious about that is because if that is legit, do you know how much shit that kid probably would have got into if he recorded his dad, the future sheriff, and started putting it on TikTok, mate? Like, what the actual f? I mean, maybe they've got a damn good relationship. He just called him his dad dude and stuff. So maybe they've got a pretty tight relationship, like a friendly relationship. But, mate, I don't know about that. So I wanted to show you that one anyway. Also, I want to point out, at first, I showed you, my very first video covering this was about the, the, the shadows out on the street that people were claiming to be aliens. And then I sort of debunked it. I said, actually, do you know what? It turns out after the HD... Um, video was released it looks like it was actually two or three police officers just walking down the street but then i saw another video today right that zoomed in and they were looking at the perspective like or, or the, the the size comparison of these beings humans police officers whatever in comparison to the police cars and i gotta be honest with you they were a lot bigger than what you would imagine somebody standing next to a police car would look like, right? These things look pretty damn big. So go back on my other one, and because like because I've got so many videos I want to show you, and we want to get to the grand finale. In fact, there's two, right? There's two. I want to do a live investigation with you right now, and also this the last one I'm going to show you is absolutely crazy. But go back and look at that HD version and just see how big these people are in comparison to the police car. Okay, so that's the first one. Check this one out as well, right? This, this one I'm going to break down, okay? Because what he says, similar to the other thing, is <clears throat> it sort of builds up, puts a backstory onto 
the video that I'm going to show you in a bit, right? This is mad. This is mad. Look, my name is Fitz. I, um, I was there at the Bayside Mall with my family, um, and we all saw exactly what happened. Um, don't, like, pay attention to a lot of the videos that are out there. I feel like a lot of people are trying to use this for clout. Um, but what happened, we all saw what happened, and, it, you know, it's pretty serious. I, uh, you know, it's been a few days, but, and, you know, our whole family's processing it. But I think we've kind of, like, uh, accepted that we were a part of this weird uh, experience and moment. Um, so basically what happened was I was there with my brother Brian, uh, and my sister and my nephew. We were looking for shoes uh, for my nephew. And then we see a whole crowd of people outside the store um, just running out in a direction. So, you know, as soon as we saw it, we, uh, we were like, oh, oh shit, you know, what's going on? So we immediately ran out with our nephew and um, you know, we picked him up and we ran out and we followed the crowd. Uh, and then about like a, a, a few seconds later, as soon as we started running, uh, my nephew, he's autistic. So he was pointing behind us and he was saying blanky which he'll usually say whenever he feels unsafe or scared. Um, and he was pointing behind us. So me and my brother, we look behind us and then we see these three, nine, 10 foot tall creatures. I'm not gonna say aliens. Mate, nine, 10 foot, 10 foot. That's the height of a basketball hoop, right? That's crazy tall. I mean, not for me, cause I could just dunk that. Uh, everyone keeps saying it's aliens. I'm not saying aliens because I don't know what it was. Uh, none of us really knew everyone. All of us stopped in our track. We, you know, a whole bunch of people were pointing at it. Uh, I mean, there were other people running. Um, you know, there was a crowd. As soon as it made itself more apparent, um, it looked like it was glitching, not like a... See, when he said glitching, that's the same thing as the graffiti artist said the, on the last video that I showed you, glitching. He kept on saying about glitching. Now the argument could be, well, they're listening to other people's stories and they're just sort of like creating, you know, it, it, it's also a bit like that phenomena of um, sleep paralysis where the question is, why is everybody seeing the same thing? Well, it's because people are always talking about it and it's just spread. So when people are in sleep paralysis, they think about all those stories. But then there's another argument about like, certain areas of don't whatever mate what i'm saying is they could be listening to other people's stories and, and just sort of like adding on to that but i don't know mate he just seems quite legit computer pixelation but like a wavy glitch um and whatever maybe was covering them had you know unveiled or whatever um yeah it looked like a glitch man uh it like a, a weird glitch in the matrix or whatever and um and then you could see it in its full form, all three of them. And then, uh, it, you know, they were all black. You saw eyes uh, and you could faintly see like, like lips. But um, yeah, I was about like tw 20 feet away um, because obviously everybody gave it distance. Right. And, um, you know, they're tall. Um, so I can't remember. What is it when you look right, you're remembering. And when you look left, you're. Top, top right is a remembering, top left is imagination. I can't remember if it's that way or the other way. You tell me. So we all just like looked at them. They were just standing there. And the thing that was a little bit weird, well, it was clearly like observing us. It was sentient, right? Like, or whatever. I mean, I don't know, but uh, it was aware of us. It looked at us, the whole crowd. And then as soon as it started walking with its big legs, like, kind of like it started like almost glitching again um we all ran um my brother like immediately said yo let's go he grabbed me by the shoulder we we bolted out of there and for anyone that's like saying you know where's the footage where's the footage yeah, yeah i know i i don't have any footage and i'll explain why because like when i when i saw it i was in complete fear it's it was something that I, I completely froze, man. I don't care if I sound like a bitch about it. Like, Well, this is what I... I'm sorry, but this is what I said on the last video, okay? About the graffiti artist saying 
about how he noticed this and this person did this and that they ran this way and this person fucking did a somersault and wait reached for his wallet and then whatever like how is he how is he taking in all that information when you have got something that you have never seen before in your whole entire life until bloody the the end game marvel came through and fucking hulk came through the bloody portal or something you haven't seen that before so you would be looking at that like holy shit okay so i gotta disagree with that comment i don't think that you would necessarily be like looking at other things going on well mate well no bollocks i'm gonna stick to what i've said yeah no absolutely i don't think you would you'd be like holy shit what the hell is going on i'm off i froze and i don't care who you are I feel like when you're seeing something paranormal, mm -hmm. it's different than when you're seeing a fight. Yeah, you'll probably yeah. want to record that and put it on Worldstar or whatever. When you see something paranormal, that's different. Because your reality, you can't comprehend what you're seeing. Mm. A fight, you kind of get it. Two people are fighting. You, you can comprehend that. Something like this, none of us could comprehend. Your first instinct is like, it ain't to like take out your phone and start recording. Your yeah. first instinct is like, I've never seen this before. What is this? Yeah. Is it going to hurt me? Yeah, 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 yeah. Because, mate, when I show you the video footage in a bit, you'll be like, yeah, I understand why you wouldn't be stopping to get out your phone and recording that shit. Or my family. That's my. That was my first number one priority. Um, so if you don't believe me, I get it. You know, it's fine. Like, it is silly. I'm, I'm sure that someone had footage from that night. If you did, please contact me just so, like, you know, we, we actually have it. Um, that made me a little bit dubious. It's like when he says, please contact me so we have it. I was like, we have it? Who's fuck Who's we, dude? Who's we? Are you wanting people to send you the the footage so you can get rid of it? That's been me like with conspiracy theory, like way out there, you know? But, but I, I just must just stress, I, I don't know what's going on here. I clearly, I'm just throwing down the evidence. I'm not too sure. I believe in aliens, but whether this went on, I'm not too sure. However... The more footage that comes out, mate, and this weird stuff. But again, it can all be CGI and all this crap. Whatever, mate. Let's carry on. So anyways, as soon as, soon as the creature started moving, we all just jetted out there. We we ran out the, the, the front doors. Um, and, you know, obviously, like, we see a whole sea of cop cars, mad cop cars where other ones were coming in. Um, and we ran with our nephew, and then, you know, a, a cop stopped us. Um, you know, they took us a little in a, to a bit of a safer area behind, right, in, uh, behind the cars. Um, and then, um, and they asked us what we saw, uh, and we, we told them what we saw. Um, you know, they wrote it down and th they asked everybody to check their phones. Not everybody, because there was mad people like running away too, right? They that makes sense that there's not many, um, like footage of this going around because like the police asked for the footage. And I did hear another comment that saying that there isn't any footage because there was some sort of electrical interference and no electrical electrical things was working. But then that would disagree with, sorry, that would counter what I'm going to show you in a bit. Anyway, let's carry on. Going to get everyone. <laughs> um, so I'm wondering if someone's going to post a video. Um, but yeah, they 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 looked through everyone's phone. I didn't record anything, so I was fine. None of us recorded anything, so we were basically free to go. Um, but in the distance, you could still see, like, you know, I didn't see the being, beings come out the door, right? Um, but you could see on the side of the building, uh, kind of like that clip that everyone's seeing, um, that it was slowly walking. And it was like, it wasn't cloaking or glitching or whatever. It was walking. So I don't know if they, it seemed more like it was an interdimensional thing. Someone's coming into our dimension or whatever. And this there, mate, right, that what he just said there <clears throat> is I've got a video that I'm going to show you that explains what he's talking about there. And I'm going to do it, like I say, live in front of you. I'm going to I'm going to see if it actually is true. A bunch of them. And I think, you know, that it, it was just interesting, the police response, because it was a whole bunch of them. Mm. This ain't for no teenagers. No, this is this was for something way bigger. Um, and it almost seemed like the cops had like a, 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 a already made strategy for it because they surrounded the be one of the beings with like all their police cars. They blared it up even louder because you could hear that it was louder. Um, 
maybe as an attempt to like distract it or let it know like hey you don't belong here right but he's saying it as in one i thought there was like three um and you know they were trying to like slowly move alongside with it um but i didn't see anything else after that because me and my family we, we got out of there we went into our car we went home um because you know we had, we had our nephew with us and we went to make sure like you know he was mm -hmm. okay um so i you know i i was i'm, I'm still kind of like processing everything like it's weird but at the same time i'm glad that we weren't alone in seeing it because like it was a whole bunch of us that saw it um and I, it, it feels kind of like you know you're part of something like really big this bit here is very sort of it made me just think oh god that's a horrible thing to if it's true to know and to feel and to go through yeah where he says it's it feels in some way it's a good thing that we've experienced it what did he say hang on <clears throat> um and uh, it, it feels kind of like you know you're part of something like really big yeah uh, but at the same time it's confusing because like you want you want to kind of like show people like i wish i took a video man like because people are gonna probably think i'm crazy right um but yeah you I, i'm left with more questions like we were all kind of <clears throat> left with more questions than see it's it's comments like that which just makes me think is this guy legit you know because you would be right you'd be almost annoyed with yourself if that was if you experienced something like that you'd be annoyed with yourself because you didn't take it in more like digest what was going on really look in take video footage like this, this is your moment right because you would be frustrated i think you would be anything else um yeah I'm not saying that it's aliens. I know everybody's saying it's aliens. I'm not saying that. All I'm saying is I saw something come in through like a weird glitchy, maybe a portal or whatever. Um, and it was like, they were, you know, they're pretty tall. Um, you could see some face, face of it. It was very, they were very dark, like, I, I, and, um, and shiny, but I can't tell if it was like a wet shiny or like a met metallic shiny. Um, and yeah and you know long limbs yeah i mean yeah long limbs long fingers um they were definitely humanoid in shape um and shadowy um but that maybe that shadowiness was like from a glitch or whatever this like keeps whatever on going on about glitch maybe they had like it's fell cloaking. off um but yeah it felt like something was coming into our world or whatever um mate. like a fucking stranger things episode but uh but it was it was crazy man like um right <clears throat> so make what you think of that i don't know i just it is what it is okay but um this was the um a police officer that actually says what went down okay so let's just break this down all right guys so just to address a few clips that are going viral on social media right now first our response to that uh big incident in bayside marketplace what happened was there was about 50 or more juveniles that were shooting fireworks at people so 50 or more it's not just a few kids with sticks 50 kids right they had reports of 50 kids and gunfire right so let's just put this into perspective if there's one person bit like out on the street shooting up there's going to be a hell of a lot of cop cars there right am i guessing let's say five minimum right so if you're talking like 50 kids you're going to be like oh shit this could go down this could wipe out a hell of a lot of people if 50 kids have got guns and they're shooting everywhere okay so that would explain why there's a hell of a lot of police cars. I'm just calling it out, right? I'm just, I'm just saying, that's all I'm saying. That would be more logical. 
There was also some looting going on, so officers that were on that scene were having a little bit of trouble containing it, so they called what is called the Citywide 3, which every officer in the city responded. That's why you saw so much police presence for, for that call to contain that crowd. Now, there is now video going viral of 8 to 10 foot aliens oh, walking right. around. Right, okay, so this is the video that I'm talking about. A lot of people are saying that the actual height of these, although it's terrible footage, the actual height of this in comparison to some of the cars, they look so much bigger. But looking at that, I'm not too convinced. I don't know. Bayside is actually just a person walking with a shadow. So well, it's not a person because when we zoomed in, it does actually look like two or three people. So I can confirm to you all here today right now that there are no aliens in Miami in Bayside Marketplace at the moment. So it's Friday. I hope you guys have a great... So that's him. I had to throw that in there because, well, we, we've got to look at both sides of the story, right? <clears throat> so then this one here, hang on. Is this the one? Okay. The this is the one that I am going to be doing now with you live. But hold up for the last video, mate, because it's absolutely crazy. But this one I'm going to do live with you now. Let's go. Right, listen. Let's see. They put the coordinates in backwards. They, they reversed them. Listen, y'all, listen. The Miami incident, right? Or at the mall. I was watching one of the victims and he said that it seemed like a portal opened up and all of a sudden these beings just came through. So it got me thinking, well, where did they come from? That's another clue to the, ne the next the, the, the video that I'm going to show you at the end, mate. From well, they had to come through a portal. So just for shiggles, I went to Google Earth, went to the mall, got the coordinates, flip flop the coordinates, put that in Google Earth, and just to see where it would take me, it took me to the center of Antarctica. Do y'all remember what I was talking about? How there's an alien civilization in Antarctica living under that ice? Do y'all remember that? Not yet, sweetheart. Sorry, one second. Not long. <clears throat> Because if not, let me remind you, there is supposedly a alien race living in Antarctica. And if they were trying to go to this alien base in Antarctica, they swapped the coordinates and ended up at the fucking mall in Miami. <laughs> Imagine that, mate. Because um, is, it, um, is it China? I think China read backwards, right? I think they do. Is it, I think it's China that read backwards. So maybe, you know, just because we read from left to right, maybe they just thought, okay, they read from right to left. I don't know. So let's have a little look at the coordinates, okay? Um, coordinates finder. Here we go. Uh-huh. Consent. Right. <clears throat> okay. And then the longitude is this one. I don't think she's got that right. Unless I'm doing, unless I'm doing that wrong, I've done. S I'm tripping. Go to Google, find the coordinates for the mall, reverse the coordinates, and it will take you to Antarctica. When you say reverse, do you mean change the the the, 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 the south to the east, the latitude to the altitude, or do you mean put the, all the numbers backwards? Because it's not working for me, love. Okay, right. So now let's try this. So that's the bay side. Let's go. Um, oh, hang on. Let's just let's just copy that. Let's just copy that a minute. Now, um, uh, copy that. Put that down there, and then we we'll put that one there Antarctica oh my fucking god mate okay right that's weird <laughs> that's weird okay that's weird that is weird mate right so the last one the last video make of that what you wish this is the last video that i wanted to show you man which is let me just say the footage isn't great okay but keep on watching watch it over and over slow it down frame by frame you will see it because it took me i was like what are we seeing here it took me quite a few attempts to actually see then when you do see it okay it's amazing now the, the the footage again is blurry as hell okay like 360p but i want you to tell me if you've ever been to that mall does it look familiar is it the mall check it out 
Yeah, yeah, I know it's gonna shh, be quiet. There it is, right there, right there, right there. See it's it? kind of hard. Right there. See, there it goes. Okay, let go it go back, back again. Let I know what you're thinking. Can't see shit, mate. Hang on. Let me rewind it again one more time. I know I'm telling you. You want to be looking right on the edge here, yeah? Right on the edge here. Yeah, they will slow over. it down and they yeah, will, watch, like, watch, stop it. Right here. Right here, check it out. Spec especially the second section. Go to the right side, right here. Okay, everybody's running. See Boom. It. Hang on. See it? We no, already did it again. It? I saw it. it. One more time. Let me do it again. One more time. Do it again. Yo, just stay with me. Right here in the right, right side. Here. Right here. Right there. See it? See it? There it went again. I know it's hard to see, but if you look on the very right-hand side of your screen, when they show the very right-hand side, you can actually see like an energy wave and mm -hmm. then something shoot out. You of can, it. mate. Trust me. You can. This is better footage. Here we go. Okay, look. You can see it. Right there. This is the steel shot. Okay. Now, what is all this? Can you see all this stuff here? Right? But hang on. That's not all of it. Hang on. See this? It's almost like a watermark. Look, all around here, but hang on. And what is that? This here, mate, this is crazy. This is crazy. And you actually see it go whoom in a minute. Now, let me go ahead and, 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 and play that part. It's going to go quick. Go just play it, just play it. Let me play it, look. Yo. See that? Yeah. Yo, he's back up a little bit. There's a run right here. Watch this. Let's go fast. Right there, watch this. Nah, man, look, it's right there. Oh, yo. see it? See that, right? Yo, yo, man. You seen this? Yo, you seen that shit, bro? Come here, come here, come here. Look, look come I'm here. gonna do right now, one. Look, right there. What? Well, there! It? Yo, <laughs> be quiet, yo, bro. Once you actually see it, what they're looking at, you see it. Yeah. There is definitely a pulse, a big energy shift, and then something comes out. When in the beginning of this last video I just showed you guys, you can also see kind of like, it almost looks like an oil, like a, a weird energy in the middle of the, the video in the mm. screen during the still shot in the beginning. Okay, so I literally just went through his video, recorded it in slow motion. Here we go. And I did some screenshots to show the differences in the energy shifts. Nice. Check it out. Pay very close attention to the right side of your screen. Look at that. Boom. Okay, watch. I'm going to go slow. Watch. You can see the Boom. Energy. Right there. Look. Right do you there. see all this? Let, let me show, show you again. Okay, watch. I'm going to go slow. Watch. I'm going to pause it. There. Look, look. All this. All this. The energy right there. And then also, also, hang on. Watch. You can see the energy. The, oh, man. There's this bit here. Hang on. Let me just show you again. Okay, watch. I'm going to go slow. Watch. You can... Right there. This is what they're saying. Something, it, this, this person or whatever it is, right? With the, with the foot, with the foot here, and then maybe the arm or something. See the energy right there. You see it? Look. Right there. It's when there's all this blurry shit, mate. All this blurry shit around right here. There. Um, I, I, I look at that as well. I go, that's dodgy as shit. That. I know. I'm, I know. I'm making up stuff in my head now. I know. I know. I am. Whoop. 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 It's just you can imagine it. Now look at the different, it's kind of like a blast of energy. Yeah. And it changes. Yeah. And there's actually kind of a dark figure yeah. in the back of it. Now in the next second or so, that black figure is gone. And more energy shift. Boom. Yeah, that is so weird. It is weird. It's just me and I'm tired and I don't feel good. I swear, as I slowed it down, it looked like, I don't know, take a look at the footage and you tell me what you think you see. But... So that is the footage, mate. That is the footage that I wanted to show you. Um, look, I don't know.
I honestly, and I'm not just saying this to try to be like, I really don't. The I, I know that there's aliens out there. I, I have this feeling that I know that there's aliens out there. There has to be, okay? It's math, I've, I've said it before. It's mathematically impossible for us to be the only ones, okay? But whether this is true, I'm not too sure. Like I've said before, is it a story to, 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 to take our minds off of other things? Is it CGI? Is it people just want to get attention? I don't know, man. But it's crazy. Anyway, you tell me. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.